Earlier tonight, at least 100 people gathered in Overland Park to spread a message of love. 41 Action News reporter Mackenzie Nelson introduces us to some of those people, sharing why they went. Nine-year-old Jessica Ma had questions for her parents this week. Hey, do you think that you have any ideas why they're doing this? After seeing reports on the news, Jessica did not understand the recent spike in hate crimes against people of Asian descent. It makes me feel scared, sad, and angry. Love not hate! Jessica joined dozens of other adults and children in Overland Park Saturday for a Stop Asian Hate rally. My sign says, don't hurt our grandparents, because I've seen on the news that many grandparents, many elders, they're being pushed pushed on the concrete or punched in their faces. And so I want to change that. Demonstrators held a variety of signs displaying love your neighbor, disarm hate, silence is violence, and many more. Organizers say the overall message of the rally, replace hate with love. With the love, we can do anything and everything. With hate, we would just basically separate our countries. Bringing people together takes conversations, including with children. I think it's just super important for parents to talk to their kids, and not just me as a parent of a, a child of a different race, um, but all parents to talk to their kids about race. The most important thing, because our next generation is our hope. With them. We can change this world and we can make this better. Before the rally ended with a candlelight vigil and moment of silence for the victims of the deadly mass shooting in Atlanta, cars honked in support of the message as they drove by. Seeing and hearing the support Jessica feels is making a difference. I feel happy, I feel proud because somehow we're going to make this work and we're going we're gonna to be respected again. In Overland Park, Mackenzie Nelson, 41 Action News. Now, if you want to show your support for the Asian American community, people plan to gather outside of Cafe Cafe on Mulberry Street in Kansas City for a peaceful vigil. That's happening tomorrow at 1 p.m. Organizers have a lineup of speakers from state representatives to Asian community members of Kansas City. And if you ever experience or witness Asian American Pacific Islander hate, you can report it to Stop AAPI Hate and Asian Americans Advancing Justice. We have both of their websites under the web link section of our website, kshb.com.